Hi Aquarius, this is your May reading and I'm already picking up some messages. You know, I'm seeing and I'm hearing hip hip hooray. So I do feel no matter what comes out with the cards, because I'm getting some mixed energies here. Like on one end, there's something to celebrate. On the other, somebody's having a difficult time because they're unable to possibly communicate with someone or they're having difficulties when they do try to communicate. Um, but communication is shut down is what I'm feeling. But I do see, for some of you, celebrations. Um, and I'm hearing hip, hip, hooray, hip, hip, hooray. I don't, so someone's having a party or celebrating. This could be a wedding. This could be a graduation, but something like that in May, specifically graduation and a wedding, um, is what I'm picking up on. Could be also somebody's anniversary. I feel like somebody's traveling and I'm being pulled to like Greece. So I don't know if somebody... Yeah, like a Greek wedding or something like that. So let's start since a card just flew kind of out, and we'll see what this is. Justice. So some of you, well, I'm. it's interesting. I think there was another reading where the first card that came out was Justice, but... Uh, I can't, uh, I can't remember what it was or who it is. I'm sorry. Some of you are going to have a big decision to make. Some of you, when I was talking about opposite extremes, like I'm, I am feeling celebrations and festivities. I do feel like somebody is getting, um, possibly this could be like a marriage license or passports together because I am feeling travel. Uh, I feel like it's to a foreign country, could also be green card, uh, student visa, something like that, but uh, it could also be somebody is going back home to see somebody. I kind of have a feeling like somebody hasn't seen, maybe this goes back to the lack of communication or, or unable to communicate. Somebody possibly hasn't seen somebody for a, for a, a while or, yeah, it's been quite a bit of time. And there's news, but it's it's kind of like, mm, I don't know, I feel like something possibly is going on. And, you, you know, you kind of wish that you'd spoken to them sooner or seen them sooner or spent more time with them. I don't know. It's coming up, but these are just... The psychic messages and impressions that I'm getting. Um, I'm also getting that balance is key because I'm picking up something about addiction. And I feel like this could be the thing that I'm leaning more towards the most than anything would probably be drinking. Um, if it's not drinking, it could be anything. I mean, it could be gambling, uh, food, sex, drugs. Rock and roll. I mean, it's, it, you know, but that's what was coming up was uh, drinking and um, sex the most. Those were the two that stand out the most for me. Some of you have a decision to make or you're waiting and a decision is going to be made, but you're waiting to hear the news. It could even be from somebody legal in the legal realms. Uh, like an attorney or the court system so that you're able to move forward or uh, waiting to hear some news. So let me angle this a little closer too so you can see it a little better. Let's pull out another card and see. Well, there's the Hierophant in reverse. This could be even job or work related. Maybe there's arguments I'm hearing within unions so this could be like a plumber's union or painter's union or electric unions, you know, work unions. But I'm also getting unions as in marriage. So there may be a big decision to decide um, in May of whether or not you're going to stay in a union, in a relationship 
This could also be regarding three people because we have three people here. Taurus and Libra uh, may be of significance. Uh, but this could be a legal battle with work or with three people that are involved. Um, there could be some battles going on. Let me draw another. Yep, there's the travel. So I think things are going to calm down if they've been kind of up and down, up and down, if they've been rocky, at least for some of you. I do feel like some of you may be again traveling but this could even be by um like this could be a cruise is what i'm picking up it's by water um and not necessarily by air although i do definitely pick up land or land and air travel for some of you um but I think where maybe there's been some harsh or lack of communication, there could be communication, although it's still a bit of a struggle, but I feel like you're going to start paying more attention to it, especially with this card, and I'm glad that it came up in the upright position. So um, I wouldn't say it's like smooth sailing, but something's going to calm down. It's not going to be as rough as it as it was at least for you know a while uh, maybe even through june isn't that interesting here i'm just noticing we have 11 and six or uh, six plus five is 11 so it's like 11 11 um thus far which is 22 which then becomes four so uh, could be, you know, the, there's arguments within the home, within the family. Doesn't have to be necessarily a spouse um, or, you know, somebody that feels like a spouse, boyfriend or girlfriend, or, you know, um, it could be also um, family, relatives, neighbors, that type of thing. There could be some legal issues going on in the neighborhood. Um, that's another message that I'm getting and hopefully things will start to calm down. But now we have the Ace of Pentacles in reverse. Yeah, so, you know, it's weird. I, I was getting that the, at the beginning of the reading there's excitement, but I, I feel like things get tempered, you know. It's kind of like two steps forward, one step back. Uh, I want to pull another card next to the Ace of Pentacles Somebody's really, um, it's, uh, there could be battles over a work situation. I'm getting that this could be something legal, going back to something legal. Somebody could be suing their former employer. There could be fighting within, uh, the, within unions or employees. Somebody could be even thinking about going on strike if they haven't already in May or striking out, lashing out. Um, especially with these cards together, I, I feel like, um, somebody's like not going down without a fight and it could be even fighting over money or material items. Um, you know, like a, there's a division and it's weird because at the beginning of the reading, remember I said there's celebrations and then I felt like there's heaviness. Um, you know, and the polarities, and this is kind of showing it. I mean, it's like, okay, things are balanced, they're upside down. They're balanced, they're upside down, and they're still trying to fight. Let's see what's underneath. Because we have two fives. So there's a lot of conflicts, changes going on here. But remember, with conflict comes change, and with change, it can be for the better. Yeah, it's just, it's a roller coaster for some of you. Um, I think th there's some of you are going through some major battles and some major changes, some major transformations. Um, temperance, uh, I think I even used the word temper earlier. I could be wrong, but, you know, there's a lot of back and forth and feeling stuck, not sure what to do. 
Look at that, the star card. So I, I heard, thank your lucky stars. So I feel like something positive comes out of something that maybe doesn't look like it can. I think things calm down, and that's why I'm focused on the word temper. Temper, but tempered. Like, you know how you have to temper chocolate? <laughs> I would say chocolate, but you know how, you, how chocolate is delicate with temperature? There might be somebody who has a temper, and you just may be dealing with a lot of kind of ups and downs. I also feel like somebody's angry, um, and they, they just have to watch the way that they speak. And that's what this is kind of about. It's... Um, you know, it's like you don't, you don't want to be in a place where you're like walking on eggshells, but I kind of feel like there could be somebody that's, something's going on, they've got a lot of pressure on them, maybe there's money pressures or job pressures or trying to find a job and it's a doggy dog world out there and there's a lot of competition uh, maybe you're trying to get a job promotion and rise or, you know, in, in the company and it's just been setback after setback after setback. But I feel, don't give up because I feel like if things aren't happening the way you want them to happen, there's most likely a very good reason for it. You may not see it at the beginning of May, but by the end of May, you'll see it. Um, and for some of you, you may be saying, well, I thank my lucky stars that things happened the way that they happened because uh, they needed to. Like there's, there's a blessing in disguise in what's going on, even though you may not see it right away. And with chocolate, it's like you've got to temper it very carefully. It's, there's some fragility going on, something that's... So... You know, um, I'm getting also wills and births, <laughs> like the kind of extreme, like as one door closes, another one will open. That's what I'm hearing. So I'm going to leave you with that, Aquarius. All right. Thank you.